Okay. This is my question. What's wrong with Soldier Boy? I think he doing too many drugs. And that shit ain't good. Because like you making yourself look bad multiple times a week. <laughs> Mo <laughs> Hold up. Multiple. And and it seemed like <laughs> you doing this shit on purpose. Like, what is wrong, bro? Like, you need rehab? Is this a call for help? Cause soldier boy, I was fucking with you like what is it? Two months ago? Real, cause I was looking at um all the views you be having on World Star. I'm like, damn. This nigga's still relevant. You know what I'm saying? He hit more he hit a million every a million plus every time he get on this motherfucker. Rappers that's up right now don't even do that, so I gave him his props. Man, what did he do? Then he had to say cheese interview, and I'm like, okay. Yeah, humble. That's what's up. Shooting a nigga ain't nothing to talk about. Ain't nothing to brag about. Just the whole interview, like. Niggas was hating on him for having fake uh, Yeezys, but he didn't buy them to look like Yeezys. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm like, okay. Okay, that's so good. Okay. Okay, because I'm really, not really to focus on something, but you know, he went down. So, and then, I just started seeing him talking crazy to niggas, saying shit that don't make sense. Then the nigga EC Marv say he uh caught him saying he got a hundred bands on his head. But okay, this one we one thing right here. Don't let EC Marv make y'all see EC and Cleveland two different things. Don't let him make y'all think we man. This nigga said three thousand dollars, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. That ain't how we rock. Not in Cleveland. Maybe in East Cleveland, because they circumstances are a little worse than ours. But we get busy. We get busy in Cleveland. But East Cleveland, that shit fucked up. But we bigger, like, it's like a small city, right? Right? Up further. You know what I'm saying? Up the way. Little city up there, shit, DC. But that's where they from. That's where he from. He ain't. I don't know if he be in Cleveland. I've never seen him. And he claimed EC, though. He from EC, obviously. But that ain't how Cleveland niggas rock, bro. $3,000, then snitching. Like, nah, we don't do that. So if he made any of y'all think any type of way, nah. Scratch that shit. Don't do no telling over here. We extorted nigga real bad, but... Way he did that shit, that shit was weird. I didn't like that shit. That shit was weird. Real talk. And then, the hundred bands. A nigga from Cleveland. Give me 50. Go bust Rico head. Give me the other 50. That's what a nigga from... That's what a nigga from Cleveland gonna do. But... For some reason he didn't want to do it or some shit. I don't know. But, I wouldn't have did it. Because I fuck with Rico. But... Then, after all that fool shit, like, he trying to, first of all, he, how you beefing with a nigga, but talking like him, like, this nigga goofy as hell, nigga tweaking, nah, bro, nah, bro, bruh, what the fuck, <laughs> how you talking, how you change your voice to the person you beefing with, how, like when he was talking to Lil Yachty, he was talking like he was from Atlanta. When he was talking to uh, Rico, he was talking like he from Chicago. On phone now. <laughs> no, he didn't say that, but he like, come on, man. He talking about you made this, this song my beat goofy as hell. You know, Rico Reckless said that shit all day. Like, come on, man. He sounded just like Rico Reckless talking. And he looked like he was on some crack. But when he was dissing Yachty and shit, he, I'm having a honey killer, nigga. Put a nigga pull up. 
oh, that's that Atlanta shit. Nigga ain't even from Atlanta. Like, it's just too much food going on with that nigga. Like, then he dancing like in the deck. Oh, like, oh, man. It was relevant for him. I was just like, 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 damn, okay. I can fuck with soldier again. You just doing fuck shit after fuck shit. And then, these niggas call your phone and tell you to beef over. Hold up. These niggas call your phone and check you talking about the beef over, don't threaten shorty. All oh, this, you talk about some mama on paper. Nigga, don't like your fuck about papers when you all the way out there. And then, at that, you, uh, you say okay. I don't know if you said okay, because the niggas turned the video off. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna lie right there. But, some understanding they had. Got it. Got but some understanding in here, and then you, you goes, you goes to take a vacation and do an interview, and go back on everything you just told this nigga. Like you said, the beef was over. You said this. You said that. Now you on the uh, black TV talking about. Um, I'll beat the shit out of them. We can shoot it out. Like, that's them drugs, man. Because I could obviously clearly tell you was on something that day. But them shades was too dark. But I could see your neck. Like, you weren't even in your body, bro. You was out your body. That's what that was. Well, stop playing. But anyway, why go back on everything you said? Like, that make nigga think you a real nigga, a real man. Fuck nigga, man. You will do all this shit, then talk about some, some motherfucking, oh, uh, I beat it, this, I do this, I do that. Why you didn't say that when you on the phone with his niggas? When they found you. Fucking rappers, boy.